Many fathers are used to putting together dollhouses or swing sets for their daughters. How about gun targets? Yeah, sounds a little unusual. Well, I show you how a girl's playground turned into a launching pad for her shooting fame. In this backyard playground, it seems normal to find a pile of casings and the proof of bullseyes. It's the person playing here who might surprise you. She does things most kids her age wouldn't know how to do and probably wouldn't be trusted to, to be honest with you. The guys at my school are all scared of me, I know that. 14-year-old Katie Francis is the one leaving her mark on this steel jungle gym. Those are LaRue targets and then the little circular things. It's called a plate rack. Yeah. The Blair Oaks freshman is a three-gun shooter using a rifle, shotgun, and pistol to hit various targets in competitions across the country. I get lots of compliments like, wow, you can handle your shotgun really good because that's my best gun is my shotgun. Katie has more than 37,000 Facebook followers, fans, and sponsors. Yep, I'm one of maybe 10 females. I'm the only junior female that I know of. Her gender and age have people watching her compete against adults. It's a guy dominant sport, yes, I get that, but it's not just for guys. Dressed in pink rimmed glasses and earplugs, she wears her fuchsia gear as a reminder to her competitors. Show my inner girl. I'm not totally a guy. This teen discovered her shooting talent as a five-year-old after her dad taught her gun safety. And I kept bugging him over and over again, hey, can I go out and shoot it? It's really fun. Beep. Chad Francis, a retired National Guardsman, also shoots competitively. To me, it seemed irresponsible to have guns in my house and have children and not teach them how to safely handle them or not handle them. She shot in her first competition at age 12. Katie's skills gained attention at a time when guns are a matter of strong debate, making the family the target of criticism. People think sometimes that it's irresponsible to let your children handle guns. I think it's the opposite. It's irresponsible if you have guns and don't teach them the proper way. Katie says the backlash won't keep her from pulling the trigger. I like to set goals for myself and reach the goals. She talked about possibly maybe going to the Olympics one day, so that may be an avenue of shooting we go down uh, with her shotgun one of these days. And for a dad with three girls, he's glad at least one took up his favorite hobby. We, we get to spend a lot of time together. It's fun. Even if it's on a homemade playground of steel, shells, and shotgun fire. With videographer Scott Schaefer, Emily Spain, KOMU 8 News, St. Thomas. That was an interesting story for me to shoot out there with Scott Schaefer. A lot of fun. Katie also sells t-shirts with the phrase, shoot like a girl. $2 from every t-shirt goes to help wounded warriors and their families.